we're getting close. What a fucking dick. <laughs> okay, no worries though. This is good because now we 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 are S tier. See, rank of S, level fifty five. We're doing good. We're doing good. <laughs> what the fuck? What just killed me? What the fuck? I didn't even look. I don't know. Um, we're playing Nine Child Street, and it's terrifying so far. And, of course, we're ready to leave, and we realized we left a little baseball cap inside. We had to go back and get it, or our mom would kill us. I'm worried something else is going to kill us! Um, my order didn't arrive. The food, right? Yeah. Should be on your table. What, you still have something to say? I'm sorry. Fucking asshole. We must have crossed paths. Like, I must have went by and she came out and put the food on. Real. Got it. Yes. What the fuck? Fuck, dude. Eight. You know what? Yeah, let's. This is worth two. Let's get that forty thousand mark. And then I unlocked this spot and haven't even looked up here yet. What's this? <laughs> Singular bottle. Oh, there's another one. Oh, there's another bottle. Oh, two down between Knox and Twy. Knox wins. <laughs> All right, Knox, I will gift you a free copy of that game. That <laughs> you got fucked. Oh my god, you got fucking wrecked at the end. That was amazing. <laughs> Tunnel of heat. Oh no. Oh fuck me, dude. Oh, they're everywhere. Oh my god. Oh no! No, 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 no. Oh yeah, that was that was the chills. Flippers off. My feet are fucking hot. What the fuck? Oh. Actually, hold up. Hold up. Hey, go over there. I got like these nice wool socks on right now. Nothing like a nice warm fucking sock in winter. Because it actually got fucking cold here out of nowhere. Not out of nowhere, but it's it's Massachusetts. We have hoods. Change the light bulbs. Jesus. He is not okay. Oh, what the fuck's going on in there? I don't even know if I want to know. Alright, good. We made our way down. What does this say? Now I'm alone, but I keep hearing stopping at night and even laughter. 
that has been absent from this house for so long. Fuck. So if I could buy, well, I could buy one right now, actually. There. And the next one I could buy here is 167. That'll be a little bit of time. Look at that, level 44. Not too bad. Hope you're feeling well, Jugs. Um, feeling a little numb at the moment, to be honest, but my edible also kicked. In. Jesus! Yeah, about that edible. Yeah, I should be in the regular supporter spot. Focus. There's Gab. I know Gab's always in here. There's so much to read. Oh, oh my god. There's so much. There I am! Far right side. That's sick. <laughs> I love it. You turn the flashlight off like that. It's not cool. Boxes are back. This fucking crazy stop. Fuck you, tree. Please. And you only buy one corporation. Okay. Well, I'm glad I just found that. This big stupid building that means dick. It's like, oh look, there's something cool here. Let's go up another level. <laughs> oh, shit. There's no need for that. All right, so we hit. Oh, shit. That's important. I need to get back upstairs immediately. Got him. My goodness. Ooh! Fuck! So far, no. Well, I guess that wasn't there before, right? Oh! No, you fucking did. Why? Why did that happen? A second. There's nothing else in here to do. Just what I can tell. We gotta get the fuck out of here. <laughs> Damn it. Do you think my key would work on the elevator? Jesus fucking Christ. Oh my god! What is that? Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm gonna die. Look at that. Can't have looked at the. What? Oh, can grab the tape now? Found a box from the previous owners. August 20th, 1997. Okay, so that helps. I heard something over here. I think something unlocked. Nope. Damn. Oh.
fucking shit balls, dude. What in the? Cause look, there's a uh, there's a present down there for me. Damn, I can't get it. I guess I have to get the last candle first. Oh, look at this. That was helpful. Who fucking you? Goddamn rats, I tell ya. I, I'm sorry, I had to wait for the clip to end. I knew what it was. It was from last stream and it was funny. But thank you, Soma, for the, the playoff for as well. Scaredy, welcome, man. Hope you're doing well. Hope everyone is doing well. It is Monday. It was. It was a Monday today. Oh, my God. Oh, oh. Uh, it was rough, but we persevered and we made it through. Business is done for the day. Twy, welcome in. Hope you're doing well. Um, so it's time to have some fun, I suppose. Um, I can tell you one thing we won't be doing tonight is any more death knots. <laughs> I need some time to recuperate. Yesterday was not a good day for me. <laughs> to say the least. Do a good hunt. Just ate too many sweet potato chips. That sounds enjoyable. Do you drink water? I just did. Um, typically, I have a... You know what? I think I have one more beer left I can literally drink right now. Well... I'm trying to save one drink, uh, one beer for my dad that he hasn't had yet. So I'm probably going to bring him to him this upcoming weekend. And then every other bottle I have is like 30, a 32 ounce beer. And I'm like, mm, no. So what the fuck? Oh. The beer was stuck to the freezer portion up top of the uh, mini fridge. That was weird. But now that I'm not suffering playing that game I was playing, yeah, I I tuned in for a little bit there, and uh, it looks like someone just took a Souls game and like, how can we make this worse? Hmm. <laughs> that sucks though. But hey, you know what? Free game's a free game. I guess you got that going for you. Um, really quick, I just want to crack this off. We're going to do another, uh, Rye Ale, because it's basically all that I have left, which is funny because it's Abyssal Brothers, and they're a very popular brewery in the Northeast. It's just this particular beer I'm, I'm not huge on. It's good, but, like, I'm not going to go out of my way to go get any more of it. It is foaming. It is very excited to see me. 17 months of whatever this is? LOL. <laughs> Love ya, homie. L L L L L L L L L L L L L L L Whatever this is. L L L L L L. Thank you so much, Wheeler. Seventeen months. That's fucking wild, man. That is almost a year and a half. Like, what the fuck? Is it the shoes? Yo, what's up, dude? This is their rye ale called Lux. It's not bad. I'm just, I'm not a huge rye ale guy. Bag of rye? Yes. Yo, ID, welcome back in. Do you prefer ID? ID Koof? Koof? Oof? IDK Oof? I to be sure. There's like 30 ways to go with that one. But welcome back regardless. Um, oh, switch that up. There we go. I'm not crazy about rye either. Yeah, and like the thing is, is like, I will dr I will drink rye, but I'm I'm more more so on the lines of like a bourbon if if I had to choose between the two, um, and like rye and beer is usually very it, it's a it's a coin flip for me. This one I think is is a it's a win, but I wouldn't say it's one of the best I've ever had. I don't really care whatever is fine. All right, sounds good. Maybe you shouldn't play a game that tells people to unfollow. Which is funny because when I closed stream two nights ago, we were at 666 followers. Now we're at 665. Damn it. Haven't drinking almost a year, but if the orange man gets arrested tomorrow, I might break it. 
<laughs> oh my god, Wheeler. <laughs> That's funny. Good. <laughs> um, so yeah, we're going to be playing a game today. Uh, it's just a demo. It's a beta demo. Uh, for those who care about version numbers, they call it 0 0.8. Dot, uh, I'm assuming that's the date 2023 So this came out February 7th of this year. So, but 0 0.8 tells me they're pretty close to being done. So, uh, we'll see how this demo goes. I don't really know much of the background on it because I downloaded this so long ago. So, I'm gonna pull it up on, um, on Steam really quick and read the uh, description to you. Drink yesterday and oof, it was disgusting. Oh man, what did you have? And uh, Unfollow is a surreal, hyper realistic horror game. Play as a victim of bullying, escaping from terrifying monsters while uncovering the mystery of uh, Akita Rest and a thrilling journey of terror, pushing you to the edge of your seat as you explore the dark impact of social media on mental health. And they think this is going to be released by Q3 of this year. So for reference, that is uh, July, August, September time frame. And they've only, this uh, dev has only done one other game on Steam. And it's called Fantasy Boy. And it, it's hand-drawn 2D platformer, roguelike. So, uh, oh no, I'm sorry. That's also coming soon. <laughs> it's not even out. Um, so they have, it looks like they're not just... Uh, horror only but they do a multitude of things so that's interesting some cheap whiskey and twisted tea oh that hurt my stomach whiskey kind of made the tea taste a little better yeah <laughs> i could see that um so just some upcoming things uh so like i said we have the unfollow demo to kick us off tonight and then we're gonna be going back into faith that pixel like um old retro style uh game and um it's been a while since we played it um we got busy with some other stuff and it, we kind of had to put it on the back burner for a bit but i'm excited to be back on it uh this thursday we're gonna be playing the pinewood valley alpha demo uh when it comes out on steam it's been on an itch since i believe friday it's been going through a lot of different changes it's like, seems like every 12 to 24 hours, there's a new update out on Edge, which is good. You like to see that for an early release game. Uh, so I'm looking forward to play that uh, since we are part of the content creators. Uh, we're part of, we're on the content creator team for the developer. Um, and then I moved some stuff around. So I, I think I did at least. Um, so Saturday is going to be Chill is Art, the radio station. Um, if I have time, I may start another one, Chill is Art, which would be on Rio. And then I also collected, I finished that collection today, actually. Um, there's a couple of games I was missing uh, from Chill is that's available. So I went and grabbed them all. I think it was like six or seven games for like 14 bucks. It was like, okay. Um, and then I'm also thinking as well, um, on Monday... A week from today, we'll be going back to Confabulation. I'd like to give it another shot. Hopefully no nausea this time. <laughs> Hopefully not. Um, and then the pretty much last stream for a while is going to be the 30th of March. That's Thursday. We're going to play Horror Tales of the Wine, and then we'll see how much time's left if we get through it. Um, Saturday, the 1st of April, I'm not going to have a stream. Uh, unless, um, for some reason, I'm just feeling up for it. <laughs> Uh, but the next day, I leave for Vegas for about a week. Um, I return on Monday the 10th, and I'll start filling out that schedule. Um, so we have that kind of ready to go. But that's the fun stuff we have lined up. Uh, and also, I completely forgot. And I think there's a replay button. Uh, earlier today, I actually... Uh, reported back to everybody that I started a Throne account, or Throne.me. If you're in the About section, or if you just scroll down a bit, you'll see a little uh, a widget down in the panels. And it's like a wish list of different things um, that I added in there. Basically all spicy foods, because I hate myself. <laughs> Not really. <laughs> but um, 
somebody was very quick to actually uh, purchase something and it's going to be shipping out. Um, they say it could take like up to two weeks for it to show up because it has to process the payment and everything and then put the actual order in, blah, blah, blah. Um, but it says it can replay the gift reaction because I actually set up alerts for it, but we weren't live. Thank you, Twy. I appreciate it. So who got me what? It's so small. <laughs> Damn it. All right. Well, if you can't see down in the corner right there, it's gone now. Uh, Laser Lady was actually kind enough to purchase the spicy ghost pepper cherry flavored hard candies. Uh, the it was the blue raspberry flavor. Uh, I'm just realizing they're now hard candies. I thought these were gummies. These would be a lot worse than I thought. Great. Uh, but there's a lot of goofy stuff in there. A uh, bunch of spicy types of foods. Arco actually left a suggestion through there. You could actually suggest uh, wish list Man, items. I'm a baddest motherfucker in the world. Moose! Jugs. Jugs. Oh, you know what? Um, we were on three last time because uh, I was doing Death Nut Challenge and was told to hold off. We would have got four with Wheeler. We should be at five with Moose. Sorry about that, everybody. This goddamn fucking counter is always fucking with me. <coughs> oh, God. Here it comes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Hot, 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 hot. Be quiet, you. Uh, but yes, Mr. Moose, thank you so much for the subscription. Uh, the continued subscription. Two months. Holy fuck. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. Yeah, Moose. Um, see, I just I wanted to give Laser a little bit of love there. Um, so once that uh, those come in, um, I'll figure out a time to eat them. Um, and yeah, like I was mentioning with uh, Arco. Arco was actually kind enough, kind enough to suggest something to add to the wish list, which I approved. Um, there's already so there's like two different two different types of ramen, and the one that he suggested is apparently a lot hotter. But I'll leave them both up and let you guys figure it out. Well, even though the description says thanks to Arco, I'm pretty sure. So fuck. All right. Well, besides that, um, there's also uh, a package of Grillo's pickles that. The hot brand, they're probably not spicy at all, um, which is fine because Grillo's pickles are amazing. Uh, and then there's also a goofy ass t shirt that says, I like, I put hot sauce in my hot sauce. Like, it's corny shit. Um, obviously, uh, not an expectation anyone will ever buy anything off of it. The fact that Laser did was insane to me, um, or more insane than I now have to fucking eat them. So. Uh, but just want to let you all know that does exist. Um, as for the Death Nut Challenge, we still have bags four and five left. I'm going to figure out how to finish it. Um, I owe that to everybody. Um, how? I don't know. I don't know. But I think we'll figure out at some point. Um, so I don't think there's really much else that I have really in terms of updates or anything. Uh, I will say... If you have not followed Channel 13 on YouTube yet, please do so. Um, all of my friends are there. All of my streamer friends. Almost all of them. Mostly the ha mostly the horror or the variety that plays a good chunk of horror. Which I we got to get Wheeler to put in some of his clips, by the way. Dip them in sour cream, maybe. Not twy. Well, t <laughs> that's true. Although we try, try, we should definitely put in that one Madison clip that scared you. You'll be in once, <laughs> and you'll make it. Um, but yeah, subscribe to them if you haven't. If you enjoy watching jump scare compilations, um, I'm in there. Knox is in there. Um, Breakfast at noon. Butt cheek bow. Code name power. Baloney boy. Fucking all them people. Those lovely, lovely people. It wasn't even that scary, but it, you're welcome to send it. <laughs> okay. Um, so, yeah. Okay. I think we're good. I'm excited to try out this unfollow demo. Um, I don't think I've seen anything about the game that I could think of. 
I hit pause on the trailer, so not to remind myself I'd remember anything. So we'll see how that goes. All right. Let's see what awaits us. Hello. There we go. All right. Uh, I already handled all of the settings and everything, so hopefully it doesn't do too bad. I did have some drop frames earlier, but it was because I think I stupidly had Facebook open or something. But it's been fine. Okay. New game. Oh. Oh, that's someone's mask. Okay. All right. Got it. Okay. What happened? Where am I? Good question. Who's Anne? Okay. This sensitivity is fucking wild. Sorry, hold up. <laughs> I could figure that I figured that out pretty quick. This oh yeah, okay. Let's put it down to one. Let's see how that works. Uh, seems to be fine. Use what? Oh, just in general? Okay. I want to get out? Please? No? Alright. Photo of Anne as a child. That kid looks miserable. Is there seriously like, no flashlight? Everything just has candles everywhere? Who lives like this? Quarter of ten. Ooh, those do open. Day and night. Steve Queen. Alternative use. What the fuck? It's just a clip? Okay. I'll leave it on for the light. What the hell is that? Just random light from the outside. Huh. What is that? Comics of Anne Part 3. Love Handles. This song would be a bop if I could get past the intro. Alright, yeah, you know what? Shut up. The lighting in this game is funky. Like, I get closer over here, and all of a sudden it's like, boom, it gets super bright. And then those, like, dim. And then they get brighter. I don't know, maybe that's just... Well, the game's kind of wigged for a second. I'm confused. Why is it... Why is Akita rest in this? Oh, that's who that... Okay, so that was in the explanation of the game. I just didn't know what it meant. But okay, so we know what... So, so the piece of a picture missing. Those are all locked. Okay. I guess I have to go upstairs already. Wow. What the fuck? Creepy. How are you, my friend? Even though you hate me so much.
photo of Anne in elementary school. This little stuffed animal. Who's that? That looks strange. Let's try the next door. Okay, that is dark as fuck. Is there a light in here? No, I don't like it. No, I'm gonna close that door for now. Thanks. So this thing just like randomly turns on on occasion. Oh, there's an attic space. Great. Everything I've ever wanted. That's locked. Locked by a mechanism. Do I have to, like, somehow run upstairs into the candles when there's lights on? I mean, it doesn't really say I can't be in the dark, but... Okay. Aha! Uh -huh, I think I found it. Lighting up over there. Who's that? Is that Anne? Like, all grown up? A flashlight. Good. Good. It's only 30 minutes late. Not that bad. Shit. <laughs> Welcome in, demon. Maybe they're around here Hate somewhere. you too. They really like candles in that house, for sure. It's like growing with my mom. She loved Yankee Candle. Unfollow, that's the game called, but why? I guess we'll find out. And also, how do I turn the fucking thing on? Did anybody see an instruction on how to turn the flashlight on, or do I need batteries? That's why I can't be... <laughs> I picked the worst times to talk. Like, and look in chat. Miss some massively important thing. Okay, <laughs> we have all of us missed it. And there's no, like... So, there's no, like, selection for, like, controls or key bindings. Fuck. Hitting every button. Oh, that's Crouch. Uh, what button did that? Oh, M for menu. Clear. Okay. Start game over? No! Yeah, pressing all the random buttons and... Fuck. My assumption is there has to be batteries somewhere and I miss them. This thing's gonna suck when it turns on and someone's standing right there. I'm gonna lose my fucking head. That door wasn't open before it was locked. Great. Two worlds. Is that foreshadowing? <laughs> Diary page one. Is... I have lost 10 pounds. I have finally reached my goal of weight. I can't believe I made it through the summer vacation. It was really hard. I was even dreaming about sweets at night. But now no one will be able to call me fat or a ball of lard again. That's mean. Starting tomorrow, everyone will have to compliment me on how thin I am. It will be a fabulous return to school. Even mom and dad were surprised. They didn't believe I could do it. They never believed in me. But I do now. Yikes. Old camera. So I can't use that? Could have some night vision involved with it too? That'd be nice. I can't turn this on? Oh. Love foreshadowing. Huh. Old CD. Sebastiano Serafini. I'm pretty sure that is, I think it's, it's Serafini Productions that, that is the developer. So I'm assuming Sebastiano Serafini is the dev. Fire on the run, alive fighting demons, Genesis, Avalon, and clear. Is this also like a, a map of the chapters when it fully comes out? That'd be something. Pasquale. 
Carna Pasquale. I have no idea what kind of animal it is. It looks like a seagull, but it has teeth like a small dinosaur. It doesn't look very smart. I wonder if it is okay to eat. Funny, because there's someone I know that hangs out in this chat every once in a while. The last name of Pasquale. <laughs> Two monkeys and one banana. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> oh, boy. Say what you want. Yeah, the whispering thing doesn't really do it for me anymore. Sorry, game. You gotta hit me with something better than fucking whispering in my ear. Got a flashlight, though. I'm doing pretty good, Demon. Thanks for asking. Oh, it's the laundry room. I guess I should have guessed. Because I was pretty sure I could see the laundry basket or something over there. It was confusing, okay? <laughs> No light switch in here, evidently. That's rough. Comics of Anne 11. So what do you think? Oh, wait. So what do you think? You like it? Yes. Well, it's nice, but I don't understand why you're showing it to us. Is that a school project? No, that's what I would like to do. I mean, for a living. Um, produce on the internet? Yes, I know it sounds crazy, but wow, fucking call me out. And how are you doing, demon? And, and, darling, I'll stop you right there before I get my blood pressure up again. You may waste your life in any way you want, only after you've devoted your body and soul to your one priority, college. You know that your father and I never stopped you from pursuing your little hobbies. But I won't anything, I mean anything, stand between you and the best grades in your class, do you understand? But, Mom, no but, Annie, your mother is right. Do you know how much you, we invested in you? All the sacrifices, the time, and the resources? And you think we let you waste your time on what, making dumb videos? That'd be the biggest disappointment ever. Bro, parents suck. Big old trash bag. So there's really nothing in here except for that little comic. I mean, it's important for like the lore and stuff and understanding. A bit more about what's going on here. Oh, yeah, that was locked. Okay, and then this has some type of some type of mechanism that's locking that's locking it in place. It's not connected anywhere there. Mm -hmm. Random. And then I think this door was locked as well. It was okay. So there's that area downstairs. That's so neat when they put comics and games. Love it. Yeah, it's a nice way to get the lore across. I thought that's every content on YouTube. <laughs> um, there's a place here that was too dark to explore before. Not this way. We gotta find that pic that piece of the picture there. Yeah, it was right here. Either left or right we have to go. Oh. Those two doors appear to be shut tightly. This one is cracked open, and that one looks like someone beat the fuck out of it. I don't like when doors are like this in horror games, by the way. And I want to open it. Okay. Absolutely fucking not yet. We'll go check the other two doors first. Playing peekaboo? Yeah. Great jump scare coming. You'd think, right? That's locked. Ah, oh, fuck me. Someone left their water running. Must be the bathroom. Alright, to the basement we go. Great. These fucking tarps are kind of creepy, I'm not going to lie. It's a very odd basement setup, but okay. Nothing under... I can't move that, alright. And that's locked. Nothing underneath. Oh, shit. Why did the door close on me? 
That's why this, the bathroom door is now open. It wasn't open before. This bathroom looks familiar. Is it the toilet running? Can't open that. Hey, we saw this picture in the last game. It sounds like it's right. It's the toilet running, but I can't do anything about it. That's odd. Yeah, I was trying to jiggle the handle. There's no way to do it. We'll keep looking. I don't like that the music just changed. The door differently closed. I don't fucking like this at all. These don't open. It's so fucking quiet, I hate it. What's going on out there? Fuck. Could the jump scare just happen now, please? Fuck. Oh, I've got shivers. I hate when I get... You know, you get locked in a room. You have to find something to get out. And nine times out of ten, the thing you're looking for is a fucking jump scare. Like, am I looking for something here? I've tried to click on everything. Can't open those up. Nothing to do with the window. Can't do anything with the tub. Can't even get in the tub? No. Can't grab any of the random bottles of toiletries. Can't touch to do with the actual faucet. Life of my cat. Meow. That's what makes it so good, demon, is not knowing. Especially when you don't know, like, what the fuck it is that you've missed doing. Oh, it's just the moonlight coming through an opening square or something. I don't even see anything out there, which is good. Wait, what's what's on what's up with the tree? Is that writing on the tree or just the tree itself? Maybe just the tree itself. I don't fucking know. Painkillers. We need a few after playing this. Gonna be right back to do dishes. I need my music. Oh, word. Gotta do what you gotta do. Get them chores done. This is bizarre. I don't. Like, nothing's on the ceiling anywhere that can jump scare me, right? No? Okay. Do I open up the door without the flashlight on? No? Okay, so it's not that. There's also ghost orbs in front of me. That's never good. So I, I don't really know. I feel like I've clicked on every single thing. Oh my god. Why? But I need something thin to reach it. How about my fucking skull, pig? 
whale. Oh my god. I've tried, Anne. Really, I tried to be your friend. But friendship doesn't work that way. Who's Grace? No more window there. Oh, good. The toilet's still running. Hey, look. Comics of Anne, too. Anne, come on. You haven't been out in weeks. Come over tonight. No, Grace. I don't really feel like it. Come on. My parents are out for dinner. We'll have the house all to ourselves. Let's have a fun night. Popcorn and ice cream. Exactly to the point, I don't want to eat those things anymore. I don't want to be fat anymore. But you're not. You're just... Just wait. No, just what? Chubby? Plump? Rotund? Say it any way you like. I suck. I really am a whale. Sorry, Anne. I don't mean to offend you. I know, Grace. You're not like everyone else. Come on, let's still meet tonight. Let's just put on a movie and no junk food, I swear. Are you in? All right. <laughs> Creepy. <laughs> I, I mean, that's... It seems like Grace was a friend that was actually trying to help us. At least it seems that way. Or maybe she was enabling us. Now the problem is I gotta figure out a way how to get that out. Something thin. She could just have a frozen yogurt. Exactly. That's a good point. That doesn't want to open. Oh, this is that hallway. Now the lights are actually on. Can't go back through the main way. Oh, that's good. Well, it's very clear which way to go now. Oh, not. Hello? Anne, I know you said you wanted to be alone, but I'm worried about you. Please call me when you hear this message, okay? Uh, thank you, IDK. Appreciate the lurk. Enjoy the, uh, enjoy learning the code. I hope it's a good language. Hope you enjoy it. <coughs> Takes a lot of practice and a lot of attempts and... But, uh, I believe in you. I think you'll get there. You can't just seek me out when you want to spew venom about another person. Huh. And then never be there when I need you. This has been going on for almost a year now, Anne. I'm sorry. I mean it. You've been my best friend since first grade. But this is not you. What's up with the e edges of everything right person. now? What the fuck? Uh, so we're psychotic. I mean, look at how like the edges of things are getting all like rainbowy and distorted. The fuck? There's way, way too many obstacles down here for somebody to be hiding. There's a handprint on this one. Can't do anything about it for some reason. And there's fucking blood everywhere. I hate this. There's like nothing to pick up anywhere, but I'm still checking anyways. We're just gonna keep on moving, keep on trucking. We've got things to do. This game is not letting me add to library. That's weird. Wonder why that is. Maybe they pulled the demo down for a bit or something. Oh, well, that's telling me to go over there, but let me just check around here just in case. Not nothing. I could try to get the key in the sink with this one. Ah, it's true. It's a good point. Do I have to hide? I can't turn on the lights or anything. What? Oh shit!
Oh god. Okay, it might be faster than I think. This might be a problem. It's like some fucking reaper. A flying entity. Oh, good fucking bye to that. Jesus fucking Christ. Fuck all of that noise. Oh my... Where's... Where's the bathroom door? What the fuck is up with the goddamn repeating hallways? This is fucked. Let me go to the bathroom, you fucker. Wow, the demo's gone. Hopefully that's... Hello? Hopefully that doesn't mean that they... Son of a bitch. So with the demo being gone, hopefully that just means they have like another version of it coming out or maybe they're closer to release than we think. Hopefully it wasn't the opposite in the sense of like, no, nah, we just don't want to do this anymore. Because the atmosphere is pretty good so far. Nice. Look at that. Now I can get out of here. Well, out of the bathroom, that is. It was like the door wasn't even unlocked. Oh yeah, this door, right? Let's just do it. Okay. Now, what else? Can I go back down here for something else now? Like, will this door be unlocked? Oh, that same key. The key works here. The, okay, the other door was actually unlocked. So this is still kind of similar looking, though. It's like a maze of fucking storage. Who designs a goddamn basement like this? This is fucked. Took that sweet 776 basement. Ah. Well, hello there. There's also writing in that tray next to the comic. Comics of Anne, part seven. I'm... Oh, he's making it. Okay. My, my brain went somewhere else with that. I'm telling you, there are always more screws than what the instruction manual says. Even if it were, they wouldn't be enough. Okay, I gave up. I officially need a break. Are we going to know for dinner? All right, as long as we are back by 9 p.m., I can't be late. I have an important live stream to do. Yes, yes, I know. We'll be back in time, Miss Social Media. Damn. I feel kind of attacked. <clears throat> In 1969, Swiss psychiatrist Elizabeth Ross formulated a theory on the stages of grieving. Modern psychology added numerous variations with different names, but in essence, the five stages of grief represent a very specific path that each person faces after a loss. The length of the entire process cannot be defined because it depends on each person's capacity, willingness, and resilience. Moreover, the stages of processing grief are not always so linear and inter... Interoscillated? Why does that look weird to me? Okay, we're not going to stare at the word anymore. Monster, what the fuck with all the cage fencing? Were they dog breeders or some shit? I'm saying. Welcome in, Monster. Monster Mom, hope you're doing well. And if you don't mind me asking, since you are a first-time chatter here, um, 
How did you find us this evening? It's, it's good they found the comics. Litter stops here. Okay. Sure it does. Oh, fuck no. There's nothing else to grab here. God damn it. All right, we'll go to the goddamn red light. Can I bring a paintbrush as a weapon? Maybe just a dark room, like it's a photographer. Nope. It's a very weird way to get to other parts in the house. Awesome. If I had to do someone the other day, let me see if I followed him too, too quick. Oh, okay. If you end up remembering who the person was, please do let me know. I'd be very curious. Yeah, it's the Juggernaut, bitch! Jolly! Thank you so much for the biddies. It's very kind of you, very generous. Hope you're doing well. Uh... Oh, that does open. What's this? What did I just take? What the... F There's no text on what I just took. Maybe it was a piece of that portrait at the front door again. the fuck oh I did that by accident look at that it's the secret door laser I'm glad to hear it dolly how you doing laser we got to you just found out that this game the demo that I'm playing right now was actually removed, seemingly. I don't know why. Hopefully, nothing negative. All right, I thought so. I didn't think. I thought that's what I had picked up. Unfollow? Yeah, apparently the demo is off of Steam. Creepy was just looking to get it, and it's not there to download anymore. Now it's 10.15. It's been a half an hour in game. Alright, so where do I fucking go now? Can I just leave? No? A lot of people said it was quite buggy. Oh. I've just been kind of dumb so far. Oh, I knock on the door. To stream anyway. Interesting. Does everything look good for everybody here? I mean, I don't have... I definitely had drop frames to start on stream for unrelated reasons. But so far, it's been, it seems pretty good on my end, and it looks like it's been decent on your end. Different knock noises, yeah. It's been looking fine. Oh, good. Maybe I'm just lucky. Just, just jump scare me already, for fuck's sakes. All right, so then back down this way. It just leads back through the basement, which we've already done. And that leads up the ladders to um, somewhere up here that we were just at. This right here, and now it's open. Let me check the, uh, the door up here. See if this is unlocked now magically. I'm doing the right mouse button because just in case I have another key that works, but I don't. House seems claustrophobic. It does. But I recall there's not a lot of jump scares. Yeah, so far it's just been like, um, the atmosphere has been very creepy. Why is this door closed now? I don't remember closing you. And then they have the random, like, bullshit in your ear. You're like, okay. 
photo of Anne, photo of Anne with Grace. Oh, they were really good friends, huh? My assumption is so. We're Anne. My assumption is that Grace, our friend, actually died, some way, shape, or form. And when also, why can't I turn the light switch on? What is this? Also, is this even a light switch? Because there's light already on. And like, what's up with the red light? Very confused. Seems like there's more than what meets the eye here. And also, there's no light switch in this room. And this is the laundry room. People don't do laundry in the dark. Like, or do they? Like, The comic, we already read that. Close this, just to make sure we're looking good. Okay. I don't do my laundry in the dark? No, not really. Right, is there anything else in here that I may have missed? Oh, what's this? Lisa's tarot. Okay, so some tarot cards. I don't know why that's such a big deal. It's the only book I can pull to do anything special with. Wow. <laughs> Thanks, Teeman. Toxic. <clears throat> Recognize late in the tarot card cover? Uh, I didn't at first, that's for sure. Yo, Bootylicious, welcome in. Stroop, what's up, dude? And that looks kind of familiar. Was that the thing that I was just chasing us in that dream we had? Yeah, I'm assuming. Is this is this Eliza? <laughs> I don't know who that is. Oh, see, I haven't played Ma uh, Demonologist yet. But that's interesting if there's some crossover. Or maybe it was just someone using the same, like, stock image or something. Either way. Nice little Easter egg. Keen eye on Dolly as always. Ooh. Fuck. Alright, so I don't I don't know what I took here. Whatever was in this box had some level of importance to it, and I have no idea where it goes. Like, I should have come out of here, right? And I did. And that door is locked. I come up here and there's nothing I can do up here. There's this other door is locked and there's like, what's all this? Random pictures and shit? No other secret books anywhere for me? No? This is where we found the flashlight. <laughs> Too narrow. Alright, so none of that does anything. So the top floor is definitely doing shit. That doesn't open. We've looked through the living room. I'm sorry, the laundry room. Living room. What the fuck's wrong with me? Um, I've already seen this picture. Nothing else there. This bottom drawer is locked for some reason, but I mean... I could see into it anyways, and there's definitely nothing in it, so it's fine. Just strange that the drawers got fucking yanked out of it, not too sure why that's a thing. That jabron sitting there like, hey, look at my cool wristbands I got from Spencer's. Creepy outside. Photo of Josh. Ooh, I love her. Can't touch that. Can't shut the light or do anything with the computer. That's a little trading card. CD. Um, that drawing. Oh, hey, that's a, um, a Doctor Who reference. I've never seen the show, but I know it. I know that at least. So 
something else was there before. So it got ripped off the wall. It's interesting. All right, we've seen that picture already. I figured I... Oh, I had to right-click. You'd be fucking kidding me. That's a load of horse shit. I don't even know what the fuck it just unlocked. But it sounded like it came from the right. Oh, maybe it's these. No. Fuck. Alright, so see there's something to the right down here or upstairs. So I got a door just wigged out. Still isn't doing anything. I don't know if there's anything in the basement's gonna be that helpful. That door's still locked. We'll go back upstairs. Maybe this unlocked. Nope. Could be the third floor that got unlocked. Hey, progress. What the fuck is this place? This better be one of those houses that would look like even worse before, and they've already been doing work on it to try to fix it. And like trying to flip it or some shit. De Demoniality of Incubi and Succubi, a book of demonology. Uh oh. This doesn't sound like a good idea. That looks like our friend Grace. I think we did something bad to her. I can't play the piano, apparently. That you go? Oh, God. What did you do? Stages of grief. Denial, anger, bargaining, depression, and acceptance. Oh, boy. We did something very bad to our friend, didn't we? I think we did. Grace? Don't worry, Anne. You will always be a good friend to me. The best in the world. My god, we had this conversation years ago. Suck you by Kinky. <laughs> yes, her. I feel like I haven't seen her in forever. I remember it was codenamed Power. Oh yeah, you know, Power is awesome. You guys are playing Devour and you were hilarious. I went over to your stream. Oh, thank you. Appreciate that. What happened? What did I just do? Touching that just activated that circle. Bad things are about to happen. I'm almost positive. Well, green, green is my favorite color. I do like the color green, but I'm a little concerned at why it's still a glowing green. I can't touch the book. I can't, explains all the candles too. All right, fuck. Uh, this isn't good. This is not good. I think we made a trade that was not a very good trade. I think you just fed your friend to a demon. I, I think I did too. I don't know if that's something that we had set up initially. Still no updates on the sudden disappearance of world-renowned online personality, Akidira. The girl has gone missing from her Tokyo apartment last week. The investigation is still ongoing, but police have ruled out any foul play. Friends claim that the last time Aki was seen, she seemed normal and happy, though an anonymous insider claimed she had been complaining about odd followers. Her boyfriend is yet to release an official statement. Aki's family flew to Japan and made a public plea this morning. Please come up. We hope for the ah! Jesus, we will cover boy. Any major update. What's up? Welcome in, bud. Alright, so someone went missing. Anything else? This house looks familiar. Yeah. 
Alright, forget that. Yeah, and the house itself, too, like, they definitely, there's, like, rooms that look familiar, but it's at least laid out differently, so I'm not super bummed out about it, at least. Like, I'm I'm cool if you're going to use the same, like, house model, but then just kind of chip it up and make it look your own way. I guess it makes it feel a bit, it makes me feel a bit better about it. All right. That door opened. We went through there. We did that. This did not open. Those have been open. We unlocked it by finishing that out. I still can't even try to open that door. There's nothing in here that looks great, of great importance. Unless I find a tape. Wait, what? Oh, no. There's no tape in there. But I'm assuming I find a tape at some point. Okay. I don't think this was open before. It was not. This is another room of, with a ton of cables. Okay. Gotta get creative. Exactly. Yeah, no, you definitely recognize the models for sure. Every horror game uses the same assets, it seems, but I do like WG when they move doors and tables and stuff. Yeah, it's, um... You definitely notice it. Like, I've seen, like, the the first level for Pacify, like, that exact house I've seen verbatim in other games before. None of it's a problem. But, yeah, I mean, it's... I get it. You're using Unity. It's relatively cheap. Oh, I think it's free to... Oh, like, look at that. This is in the last game we just played. The same exact thing as Spaghetti and Meatballs. <laughs> Cooking with Jun. Food for a happier and healthier lifestyle. Look, the cats fucking love it. June's, June, sorry. Pacify house, yeah. <laughs> yeah, and in time, like, if a developer really works out and they're, and they're figuring stuff out using these, you know, not so original assets, eventually they can create their own or find someone to create them, you know, and go on from there. All right, so we're here just for the comic book then. The whale has arrived. Hide the chips. That's rude. But aren't you afraid of sinking with all that blubber? If you cannonball, you'll empty the pool. Come on, let's see if the fatty floats. No, what are you doing? Leave me alone. Oh, that's so fucking mean. Like, what the fuck? People suck. There's really nothing in here anyways, except for the cookbook and spaghetti and meatballs that I can't eat, which is maybe a good thing. Uh, excuse me. The hey. fuck was? Hey, you. you're Aki Dearest. Hi, um, Aki Dearest. Okay, so this is the person what are you talking about earlier. Here? I don't know. IDK. I can't remember anything, and I don't know what's going on. All I know is that I need your help to get out of here. I don't know what to do. Break the TV or something. I don't think that's how that how? works. I don't care. Hurry up and do it. Yikes. And for real, Scaredy, it's like... This took a weird turn. Yeah, I'd say so. Alright, well, I broke the fucking TV. Hello? I don't think that worked. I really don't. Alright, that's locked. Oh, watch the door. Watch, see the doorknob? Watch. <laughs> I bet you don't see that if I... Nope, okay. So that definitely is a little silliness. Okay. Um, this is odd. This toilet's still fucking running in here and I can't do anything about it. She'd gone. How do you break a TV? I mean, took it off the wall and smashed it. It's plasma. Uh, nah, I'm a pass. <laughs> I wouldn't listen to the demonic voice of the TV if I did recognize their face. To YouTuber that I haven't watched it forever, I may start again. <laughs> Sorry, anyways. <laughs> yeah, I didn't recognize the name, but, um... That makes sense now. That's pretty cool, though. Imagine, like... Imagine having your likeness in the game like that. I don't know, I think that's pretty cool. How do I fucking get into this room? I'm like... Oh, I can't, because this thing's blocking the fucking way. 
So there'll be another way in somewhere else. So maybe there's another door upstairs I haven't opened yet that I'll now be able to open and I can drop down. I don't know, say like this door right here. God damn it all. There's no other way around here, right? Like this just leads back to the ladders. Yeah, it does. Okay. Fuck. This place is a fucking mess, by the way. So, there's not many other places I can go. I feel like I've been everywhere. I shouldn't have to go down to the basement again. I don't think there's any locked doors down there. At least that I can think of. The door upstairs is unlocked right even in there. Fuck. Yeah, I think we're... I think I'm gorked. Yeah, because I can't open this up. I've smashed the TV. Wait. That's what the noise went. The, the fucking refrigerator moved backwards. What the fuck? Who designs these houses? Insane. I don't like that, but I got a videotape. I, I, I hope this is just a hiding place. Because there's, there's nothing else here. Why did I come in here? Uh... No, like, for real. I can't do any of these pipes. They do seem way out of place, though, I will say. Something to note. Oh. Dirt. This is the door. I'm such a dummy. Does this door open up now? If not, I'm gonna go put the... Bro, what the fuck? Man snake, it's it's something. What the f fuck? Heart milk spaghetti. Okay. Takes 35 minutes, three people, medium level. One heart, half liter of milk, spaghetti with leftovers, and meatballs. Well, I know where the meatballs are. <laughs> Cut the heart into strips. Great. Set half aside for the garnish and dice the rest. In a saucepan, add the milk and bring it to a boil. Add the cubes and cook over medium heat for 15 minutes. Take the leftover spaghetti noodles with the meatballs. Roughly chop them up. You don't need to be precise. So have fun. You can even use your hands at this stage. That's weird. Remove the heart from the heat and add the noodles. Stir vigorously. Put it back on the heat and let it simmer for a few minutes. The bright color of the heart and the dull color of the meatballs will give your dish a reddish-brown hue. Don't knock your socks off. Remove from the heat. Turn to a serving dish and decorate with the strips of heart you set aside. I enjoy growing them, but you can let your imagination run wild. Serve hot. Be sure to watch out for splashes. The milk can be deadly when hot. Bro, I'm sorry, what? And now you're moving? There's a fucking hole in you. Are you good? What do you... Where does the rest of that go to? Fuck. Uh, take it easy, Dolly. <laughs> Hope you have a lovely day ahead. Alright. Here's our spaghetti and meatballs. We need some milk. 
Does the refrigerator open now? No. All right, well, one thing at a time here, right? So I need spaghetti and meatballs. Got it. I need milk and a heart. Okay. Where the fuck am I going to find milk and a heart? Also, I can watch this videotape, so let's watch the videotape first. The animal in you? Oh, God. This should be good. I agree, laser. Welcome to The Animal in You, where we try to make sense of your life through valuable lessons from the animal world. Is this great? Today's question is, are you in self-denial? Are you hiding your head in the sand? Are you acting like an earthworm? What? Well, there's no doubt about it. And the dark depth yes, of the ocean. you are an earthworm. Who just keeps any kind of heart Something in their fridge? I mean, unless wrong, you fish. You pretend that everything's Maybe. all right. You deny it. You shy away from the light. But let me tell you something. Go ahead. As you're crawling and cowering in the dark somewhere underground, you're missing out on what's above. Uh -huh. All the flowers and the plants out in the sun. You can't see them thrive. Or maybe you don't care. Actually, you're neglecting them. But if you don't take care of plants, do you know what happens? They die. And ignoring them will only make them die sooner. So, Instead of running away from your problems, why don't you start crawling to the surface? Why don't you start to love yourself and take good care? Don't you want to share I am the, the worm. With flowers? Huh. First time I've heard someone called an earthworm. Yeah, no shit. Like, should I be, like, insulted or something? Anyways. So that wasn't super helpful in any way, shape, or form. Um, we do need to find a heart and some milk. You still want to open. Okay. So we'll just, uh, we'll go upstairs and we'll go through the different floors looking for a heart and milk. That door still won't open. Heart and milk. Anything else to do up here? No. Oh, look at its eyes. Our buddy downstairs is missing eyes. I wonder if that's part of it. Hmm. Yeah, Jug, love yourself. Those just introvert? What? Anything behind the door? Nope. Alright, so that wasn't super helpful. That won't open. I don't think I saw anything back here that would have been helpful. Yeah, it's, I already took the uh, piece of the picture from that. I'm not about to go down into the basement from there. Be stuck on the opposite side of it. So not that... I don't think there's going to be milk or a heart in the laundry room, but you know, nowadays, can't be too certain. Let's go here. Still can't do anything with that. No milk, no... There's a heart in the bed. Don't worry, I got it. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Steven, for the lurk, man. All right. Let's uh, go find some milk. This guy had a cat. Some people think that cats typically drink milk from a little saucer. So maybe we'll find some. Maybe we won't. Hey, maybe there's milk in the fucking bathroom. 
Wouldn't that be the fucking day? How are we doing, Earthworm Jim? Huh? I don't really know where I'm supposed to make this either. Like, I guess the kitchen would be helpful. I just don't actually have to do anything, it looks like. That's good. You just kind of dump the shit in there. Alright, let's find our milk. There's something back here in this room, maybe, and I just didn't see it? No. Alright, that's fine. Completely okay. Our milk. Don't worry, I gotta find the milk. He's just like, ah, uh, feed me, ah. Uh. So maybe there's milk in the basement. It's just the only place I haven't really searched for yet. Why there'd be milk in the basement is, you know, I, I guess as good as mine. Anybody got some milk? Anybody got that milk? I really would like some. Malk? Malk, please. Oh, feed me. <laughs> there we are. Back here again. And once again, I'm asking for your financial support. Because we've reached the end of the basement, and this just goes back up to uh, where we were before. Which, I guess at this point, I'll just take... And just clear out and make sure there's no other areas where milk could be hiding. <laughs> yeah, we're trying to make him some spaghetti and heart blood pasta dish. It's laundry powder. Uh, okay, none of that's helpful. I need the door to stay open, preferably. Baguette! <laughs> Very good disconnected. Very good. Alright. There's gotta be fucking milk around here somewhere. Like, did I, did I just miss it somewhere? Hey, I have nipples, Fokker. Can you milk me? That's sugar. That's not quite what I need. Rabbit jars? <laughs> okay. My god, if somebody sees the milk, please say something. Ask the worm guy. He knows. Does he, though? Because I'm pretty sure he hasn't said a word yet. He just, you know, kind of scared the fuck out of me, and that was about it. Like, there's really no kitchen in here except for where we just were. And it's not super helpful. You don't talk, though. Yeah, exactly. Is this supposed to be milk? Nope. Oh, that's bleach. It might still be good, but I don't know if it's going to be a good substitute for milk. <laughs> oh, my word. Yep, that's Josh. You'll love you, Bubbles. Ain't no milk in here. The, the heart was here, though. We saw that, and it was very odd. So, okay, we've done that. Where else could there be some milk? Is there someone here and I just wasn't looking? Oh, good. We got another rabbit jar. Photo of Anna's a teenager? Bullshit. That's, that's going to be late 20s. Don't fuck with me. I tried again anyway.
Rabbit jars, rabbit jars, rabbit jars. Bro, I need some milk. I don't know what the fuck that thing is. Alright. Double check the bathroom. Maybe there's milk in the toilet. Blah. Literally, rabbit jars fucking everywhere. I thought that actually in the toilet. I mean, it's been gurgling the whole fucking time. Oh my god, I'm so dumb. I got it. It was it was in the pantry rather than being in the fridge. So, give me a little soured. Sorry about that. Milk doesn't belong there. It does not. It wasn't there before though. Yeah, it was before I found him. So I think the door opened at the same time that the fridge went backwards maybe. No, that's the wrong order. Anyways, we got food for this jabron. Here you go, bud. Heart milk spaghetti. Looks delicious. Just, just toss it on the fucking counter. The fuck? So it's just gone? The fridge is gone too. Plate and all. Shove it in there. You're so hungry, you ate the plate too. That was so delicious. I think I'll have it. I think I'll have it again. He ate the fridge too. Seems that way. What the? The fucking classroom. Fucking kids suck. I thought that everyone would have noticed my change when I went back to school with my new look. They'd been making fun of me for years. They'd make me feel like a freak. And after I starved myself for an entire summer, nobody even came to me to apologize or say something nice. Nothing. I'm not their freak show anymore. And now they don't see me. Wow. But they won't ignore me forever. I'm better than them. I'm special. They'll be forced to look at me. To come back to an empty house and no one misses you. You go catch well if you give living in it's a good concept and I hope they do more with it. What the fuck was that thing in the kitchen though? And I'm probably gonna get fucking DMC8 for this. Watch. And they're like, you can't upload this. Like, I didn't put it in the game. Fuckers. Yeah, it wasn't bad. Hmm. Can I skip it? No. Well, oh, I can all tab out and that'll actually get rid of it. <laughs> I'll put other music on instead. Yeah, Twitch will probably mute it. You're right. You right. Influencers. Yep. Aki Dearest. Elisa True Crime? Okay.
I don't think I recognize anybody else in there. But that makes sense, though. Like, those random things I was picking up were taking nods at other streamers and influencers. Huh. Yeah, they're usually good at doing that. But then, of course, if you download it to upload to, like, YouTube, YouTube fucking bitches and moans about it. All right, so I think that's the game. Yeah, that's it. So that's the beta demo. Um, I wonder if we ever see that go anywhere else. Yeah, to save you, right? All right, it says check out the full game visit store page. And when I do that, planned release date is Q3 2023. So yeah, so that's the main page. To ha yeah, it doesn't have the demo here, but there is an unfollow demo page. And if I click on that. Wow, actually. Huh. Yeah, I guess the demo is gone. I got smacked on YouTube today when there wasn't any music, just me going through game settings and game had nothing playing either. Yeah, I've had that before too. Newer to Twitch, YouTube tries to fuck everyone, for sure. They really do. <laughs> We're glad to have you here, Monster Mom. Huh. So that's interesting. I think they did take the demo down. I wonder why that is. Because I don't think there's been any updates about it. See all updates. Latest was February 10th. It was a live stream broadcast of it. I'm assuming they played the demo back on February 13th. Yeah, there's no notes about them not continuing forward with it, so that's weird. Yeah, it could have been with the bugs being reported for sure. It's just weird because I mean I didn't have any issues with it, and I definitely down I obviously downloaded it in time. I don't know. That's weird. Oh well. Hopefully that's not the end of it and they get to play some uh Excuse me. They need to do more work on it and release it in full because there's other like um, short looping videos on their stream on this Steam page and like some of this stuff looks fucking weird. Uh, the only trigger warning on it was um, for epilepsy. Um, the mature audience stuff was just like I think it was like blood and gore and language, but that was really it. Oh, well, well, um, I'm just loading up faith right now. Excited to be jumping back into this game. It's been a minute since we've played it. Okay. Ba, ba, ba. I've updated the stream shit. All right, let's uh let's head over. Uh but for some reason, oh there we go. It's like there's no continue option, though. Oh, wait, did I say continue back? It's the... I 
can't escape it. God damn it. Ooh, love this. Yeah, I, we played this once before and I thought there was a save game option. Continue right here, okay. Found 16 out of the 20 notes. All right, continue chapter one. Duh. She is here. She is here. I guess I was the only one who thought to check in the attic. When I got up there, it was freezing cold. I found Amy standing in the back, looking straight at me like when I first met her downstairs. We spoke briefly, although it was tr uh, frustrating to talk to her, or it. I experienced a bit of deception from the demon. During our conversation, she uttered my mother's first name, and in other instances spoke perfect Latin. I called for help from the others, but nobody came, so I raised my crucifix and began the rite again. this thing up here oh right that just gets rid of them Bob must be stationed somewhere in the Middle East because he sent over this weird looking doll for Amy's birthday I'll ask Anish about it next time we have book club she looks like she could be from over there oh my god I remember this part now that's so fucking bad Amy didn't seem excited to see the doll I think she would rather have a phone instead Maybe seeing a baby doll makes her feel self-conscious about working at the clinic. Yikes. Big fucking yikes. Move my mouse out of the way. What the fuck is that? I forgot you'd die like that really easily. Mortis. Mortis. Somebody just played the Demogorgon noise, and I don't know who it was, but thank you so much for the bits. It did not want to log anywhere. Yeah, skip this. I know. She is here. So, I think I have to, like... Use the crucifix just enough to kind of like sketch her out, and then she goes away for a moment. And I can't sprint or anything. There is no sprint button. She's just consistently running. If you have to leave the room to be able to do that, it's pretty stupid, actually. <laughs> I can't see you. Fuck! To Simon. So I get this whole room to myself. See if I can figure out anything. And none of this shit is selectable and I can't do anything. God damn it. I, because I bet you go to another room, it's going to instantly come back. Alright, I've done the whole thing. Beds, nothing. And we'll do one more patch over here. Okay. All right. Oh, the stairs right here. Fuck. Oh, fuck. 
So I guess it's all in the timing. Or luck. I bet you I can get this one to disappear. Ha ha! Got him. Space. Oh, that's just uh, that's the family there. And that girl is uh, all sorts of fucked up. I guess I'll try this room over here. Where is it? Got him. Hm. I'm not a vampire. Right, this room seems pretty empty. Nothing to do in it. That's okay. To the next room as I waddle to and fro. Where are we? Where are we? TV, I think. Yep. I Fuck, I did it wrong. <laughs> Fuck. Mortis. Mortis. So am I not supposed to look at her, but then throw the crucifix up anyways? Maybe that's the play. Let's try it like this. Nope. So I have to be looking. Oh, I wish I could fucking skip this part. It's getting old. Excuse me. Got it. So it was the duck. I don't feel safe in my own home anymore. I hear voices outside around the house at night. I don't let the twins go out in the woods to play because I'm afraid of what's out there. The house itself feels stressed, distorted, slanted somehow. It's like I'm walking through a carnival fun house. Amy's condition has only gotten worse. I can't stand to be around her and I don't know why. She doesn't seem like herself anymore. I want to take her to the doctor, but I can't leave the boys here. I find that the phone stops working throughout the day, and now I can't seem to find my car keys. Thank God Bob comes home tomorrow. Oh, boy. Bobby. This toilet needs to be exercised. So, like, every single room in this house has something that's kind of colorful looking. I don't want to get into that. Oh, here we go. Shit. Get out. Girl, I am trying. Bobby. Oh, fuck. I'm dead. When I made it.
Fuck. So obnoxious. <laughs> like, I just find it weird that it, it doesn't work all the time. Like, to try to exercise. Like, well, not exercise, but like... Get her to, like, fly upwards and out of the room. I remember coming down here before. Ay ay. Like I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing with any of this. Fuck. Not dying. Thank you, Tree. Where would I be without you? Get out. Get out. Don't die, the game. Pretty much. Like, I'm confused at what my objective is here, like, just to try to clear out, clear out all these different little things, and then it makes her grow weaker or something? I mean, that would make sense. But no, 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 no. Uh, why isn't the duck working anymore? It's beyond me. See, so yeah, that's complete luck. I don't know how I'm doing anything different. Well, I guess the notes could be helpful. I don't know what crux or clavis means at the bottom. I mean, I have a crucifix. A clavis maybe is a key. This note is missing. This note is missing, 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 missing. I my Nothing helpful there. Ah. 
So yeah, this just kind of covers the story. We're at the red house at the top right here. The well's in the middle. There's this big old tree here. And then there's that little second hut. And then the, the main road down here. Which I've already done all of that. So my assumption is that I have to actually clear everything out. That was close. Fuck, it like doesn't let me clear anything if they're in the room. If this girl's uh, if the spirits in the room, demon, whatever. Little cat beans, welcome in. Happy to have you. How are you doing today? How did you find us? Do you go through killing her every time the multiples of her come at you? It doesn't let me. So watch. See. Or do I have to guess, do I have to guess the right one or something? I guess I'll try that first. Maybe I have to like rotate and find the right one. Which would make a lot more sense. Whereas like the other thing where she like gets zoomed up through the ceiling is more like a crit, like I'm uh, like a, a crit rolling or something. Give me a second, I'm driving. Oh my goodness. Please be safe. <laughs> you can type to us later once you have figured out your 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 uh your driving situation. Okay, ready? Uh 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 Oh shit! Yo, monster mom's got it figured out. Thank you. Appreciate that little hint. Alright, we got this one already. So we got to do this in every room, and then I'll be able to, in each room, handle the situation. Alright, well that was easy. I really can't open this door? That's too bad. Alright, so maybe this plant is the problem. The plant is not the problem. I don't know if I can really... I forget how to tell which one it is, but yeah, one is the real one. Oh, okay, so there's gonna be some other sign about it. And you can tell. There's actually nothing in this room that's helpful. Same with this room, but hey, we gotta smoke her out, we gotta smoke her out. Oof. Yeah, I'm not too sure of why or how, but it's a thing. There's nothing in this room. Is this Simon Says game? It is. She shouldn't be in this room. Right, good. Now, if I defeated them in the previous room, are they still defeated in the room? Or her, rather. No, she comes back. So I just kind of... I think it's how you get around it. Fuck. It, was, it didn't turn around. You said that real Amy will blink out of sync with three illusions. Oh, she blinks? Okay. Or she's the one that doesn't blink. She is here. All right, but now we have an idea of what we're doing, so this is good. We know the room to the right is worthless. <laughs> Yo, little cat beans! Thank you for the follow. Welcome to the mob officially. 
Yeah, I can't figure that out that fast, Tree, but thank you. <laughs> so that officially brings us back to 666 followers. Fuck yes. Alright, another note, which we already got. Fuck you, I can make this. Bye. Either someone unfollowed or it um it was a bot. Got it. And then I don't think there was anything over in this room. I'm gonna double check. No, there definitely wasn't. It's just her being a ding dong. This thing's got two different areas here. So I could search. Ooh, that was close. That's not doing it. Can I look at it? No, there's like no. Well, I can guess I didn't press enter. There's no mouse control on this at all. All right, so none of those things. It's me, Austin! Oh, oh, son of a bitch! Oh, son of a it's bitch! It's me, Austin! It was it's me, all along, Austin! Son of a bitch! That doesn't work. Can I do something with the TV? No. All right, now we go to the basement, I suppose. But now that we're back in the kitchen, I just need to get over here. Gotcha. Okay. This one. Shit, that was close. <laughs> what the fuck? That's what it sounds like. Well, shit. What's this? Wait, why did... That's the doll. How did it get down here? I heard a door open upstairs. Might as well go check it out, right? It was me, Austin. It was me all along. Uh, okay. Awfully quiet. Too quiet. Let's check all the way upstairs. Oh, I bet you it's the door with the blood behind it right up here. Yep, to the attic. That makes sense. Molly, the church might contact you in a few days to tell you their version of what happened to me. I want you to hear it from me first. A year ago, I was involved in the exorcism of Amy, of Amy Martin. I almost said Emily Rose. Of Amy Martin. What they said in the paper about what happened isn't true. She, my superior father, with when I confronted her, she managed to cut the power to the house and her own parents with their own. I have to go back to that house. The nightmares I'm having are real. She's still there waiting for me. I can still help her. If I don't come back, know that I love you and I'm sorry, John. Hmm. Not the demon attic again. Uh. Stop. Fe fucking fiend. Beast. Okay. Oh boy. My god, what happened to you? Do you see my face in Oh, it's time, baby. Stroop with a raid. What is up? Welcome in. Perfect timing. We're about to have a boss fight, I think. What if he's the one that was riding the dirt bike? It's time, baby. Is this the forest? He had nothing. Literally nothing. Some dang clothes on. Yeah, I just searched him. 
Oh no, this is fucking. I thought I heard somebody. Let's go. We're out of there. This is either PUBG or the new Call of Duty uh, Tarkov Light. One or the other. Either way, Stroop, welcome in. Thank you for the raid, man. Hope you're doing well. Um, thank you, Raiders, for coming in. Uh, if you all are horror fans, you are in the right place. We are playing um, this older game here. Knox, shut up. Just tell me what the fucking name of the game is then. Um, uh, so yeah, we're playing Faith, the Unholy Trinity. Um, interesting pixelated horror game. Yeah, the game's called... Yeah, I think it's pretty sure it's Faith, the Unholy Trinity. Um, this game was given to me by a friend of mine uh, a couple months ago. And we played it a few weeks ago uh, for a bit. And now we're kind of revisiting it. Um, if you find you enjoy watching horror, uh, specifically streamers being jump scared, highly recommend Channel 13 to everybody here. Uh, check them out. Um... They make some great jump scare compilations. Uh, myself and a bunch of other friends of mine, uh, streamer friends, are also in there. And it's just, it's fucking fantastic content. Like, I laugh at myself being scared sometimes. <laughs> it's really good. She is mine, priest. I don't fucking think so. What the fuck? Okay, hold up. What the fuck? So while he's so while he's moving, I can't do anything then. My god. I have to finish what I started. Right, wait for a top right hand corner. Okay. It's not working. It is not working. <laughs> this music is kick ass right now, I will say. Fuck, I'm out of the zone! Oh! Oh! Don't tell me there's another one coming. Oh, no. This is gonna be fucking impossible. Ah! I did it. What the fuck? Oh. This game is called... The game is called Scum. Interesting. Well, thank you for telling me. Love the music. Alright, cool. It picks up at this part then, at least. I'm like, I did the whole fucking fight over again? God damn. So I have to be able to tell which one it is real quick and then hold my crucifix there, I think. There. Am I supposed to spin around and fucking bop that up again? Jesus. That one came from up top. So I feel like that one means I, I failed the first part. Because I can't avoid that. Ah. Fuck, I tried to be keen with it. 
It's very true, monster. Very true. I would not be thrilled. But okay, I think I'm starting to understand this concept. Fucking dodge and weave shit. Hello? Ooh, I almost didn't dodge that in time. No! Got a jumper. I'm gonna get there. I'm gonna get there. We're gonna get this done. Almost didn't get out of there in time. Oh. Ooh. I was trying to get a bit more. I didn't think I hit her enough to be able to make her do like the try to attack me from the side. Oh shit. Oh no, what the fuck was that? Oh, she juked me out of my shoes. I thought I was doing like endgame. I was like, oh shit, I'll go back. And then she fucking nailed me. Fuck it again. Ah! Doo 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 doo. Just fucking die already. Fuck. I couldn't move. Oh my god. How many of these do I have to do? Ooh, shit, that was close. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Oh shit. Like someone keeping track of like how many times I have to do this? It's the countless. Am I doing the right thing? Oh, there we go. Oh. What the fuck? What the fuck? What am I doing here? What are we doing here? What? What's up, Polish? Uh, I am. I'm a little confused by th this fucking boss fight. Oh, God. Like, I don't understand, like, the pattern. It's, it's, 
that happens right there. All right, so that doesn't work because it's not solid. And then I'm gonna move, I'm gonna move, I'm gonna move. Okay, same thing here. Follows that path every time. Okay, I get it. Oh, fuck. I don't know why that scared me so much. Why is it working? My thing doesn't work anymore. I don't know why. What the? All right, we're doing multiples now? That was supposed to be a little bit faster. Someone tells me it shouldn't be in the pentagram. Well, they're just, she's just doing the, the pattern. So I can just dodge it. See? Oh, okay. I guess I can't be in that circle. <laughs> can you cross her when she stops in the corners? That's what I've been trying to do. You just can't be within that circle. If I could still hit her like that. Well, like, I can't I can hardly reach that spot. Country roads, take me home to the place I belong, West Virginia. <laughs> What's Mountain up, Mama, take me home. Country roads. Country roads. Hope you're doing well, pal. What happened? What happened there? Why did she decide to attack so much faster? Rush 2112 album cover? So I'm not in a circle. What, why is it so much faster? Mortis. Yes. Like, wasn't that, it wasn't as fast this time, I don't understand. All right, that was my bad, I went inside the circle. Totally just saved myself with that. No, 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 no. What the fuck is that? I wasn't in the circle. I was just trying to back up anyways. It was kind of close. Country there it is. Take me home to the place I belong. West Virginia. Can't reach that one, fuck it. It's going so much faster now. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, fuck! What the fuck? <laughs> I didn't expect a gray guy to come running out. Thank you, Tree, for the bits on the uh, country roads. Back it up. Best soundtrack ever, by the way. I missed much faster. 
Fuck. Why? Thank you. I don't know why it didn't fucking work. Eight pixel farts. Fucking No, 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 no. It doesn't want to work. I don't know why it doesn't work when it's solid like that. Block goes in the circle, too. Again, how much longer is this boss fight? There we go. Hello? Hello? Aha. I see. It appears you have jumped out the window. Part 28. The Dracula game for Sega? Yes. Um, alright. Well, we're just gonna... We'll just leave. No big deal. I guess she jumped to her death. That's, uh... One way to handle the situation, I suppose. Damn. Kill her? That is a random rifle on the ground, is it not? Oh, oh, great. How do I shoot it so I don't fuck this up? No instruction. No idea. I can't go out back. The bullet's meant for you. I hope not. I wait for two seconds. You figure out and beat it. <laughs> well, I've been sitting here for a while. Like, can I go out back here? I don't think so. I think it's all marked off. Oh. Oh, I'm out back. What happened? Unless that was actually the front, because look at the top of it now. It looks like it's blown open. So, yeah. Problem is, I don't know what button to press. I'm assuming it's spacebar. It has to be spacebar. Because that was the same as using the crucifix. I also don't know where the hell she's hiding. This map is quite large. You always have that spell for yourself. <laughs> There's a bunch of different endings. Oh. If I just return to my card, is that just, is that an ending? Like, all right, fuck it. Probably is. Let's go to the, uh... I want to go to the shed. No, let's go to the tree first. Since tree's here, we'll go to, we'll go to the tree first. There's the tree. Ain't nothing special about it. All right, now we'll go to the shed. I believe it's going this direction. I should eventually get to. Killed her. <laughs> See? Problem solved. Music stopped. That means it's game over. Yeah, I got to the shed. All is well. <laughs> I can't go into the shed. Huh. Okay. You fucked that deer up. I did. Alright. 
Oh yeah, what was this thing? I think I saw this before. Yeah, I know I, I actually, I definitely used the crucifix on it before seeing if it would do anything. All right, well, I guess we'll just head to the car and we'll take off. It's been a long night out here in the woods. Fucking shooting deer for no reason. <laughs> Guy's got some extra little uh, oomph to his steps, I see. He's like, oh, I killed something today. Praise the Lord and pass the ammunition. I will say of the Lord, he is my refuge and my fortress. And my fortress. My God, in him I will trust. I shall not be afraid of the terror. Really? <laughs> uh -oh. That deer fucked you up. Deer ending. What in the fuck? Ending four or five, the hunter. <laughs> so I guess I was supposed to just leave. Understood. Unidentified body discovered near wrecked car. The site of a deadly car accident was discovered along a road near Sterling this morning, along with the body of a person who has not yet been identified. At 6 a.m. this morning, a resident called to report an accident along Snake Meadow Hill Road. Driver of a silver sedan had swerved off the road and struck a tree. A spokesman for the police com commented that the body appeared to have been dragged several yards away from the car, deeper to the woods after having been ejected from the front windshield. It was noted that the body had been mangled beyond recognition. Investigators suspect this was probably the work of coyotes. It was deer. <laughs> Police also noted that parts of a cleaned white-tailed deer were found in the trunk of the car. From a white-tailed deer, a hunter typically gets 75 pounds of meat. However, it appears the victim of the accident was only able to carry 25 pounds back to the car. Interesting. New background unlocked. New chapter mode unlocked. Ooh. Awesome. We did chapter one. Chapter two. New game. Confirm. <clears throat> Father Garcia, you are hereby instructed to release Michael Davies from your custody and return him to his home immediately. Mr. and Mrs. Davies have already been contacted by our office. A representative of the church is currently en route to make sorry to their home to discuss, woo, to discuss compensation in return for their discretion you will meet our representative there and accompany him back to Rome Cardinal Gifford can I take that please no great awesome Hell, these little things everywhere. Two weeks? Oh, God. Three months? Oh, yeah, it just shows how they've changed. Okay. Maybe I just walk over and I'd be able to see it without being stupid. One day? Okay. So, yeah, so one day it looked a little out of whack. Two weeks looking pretty fucked up. Three weeks looking like not that same kid. Great. What the fuck? How are we doing today, Michael? I want to go home. You can't go home until you get better, Michael. Can I see mommy and daddy? I need to make Your mother you sucks cocks in hell. Make sure she let you be Tony. Okay. If you find them to be demon, demon. Pendejo. Like the Russian sleep experiment. Oh, 
clock. Something just spider walked in place on the bed. Oh no! Fuck me. Oh shit. God damn it all. What is he eat? What are you eating? What the? Dios mio, what have you done? Dios mio. I have so much as a pig. You can buy some food, Evo. You shall drink the rest of the Almighty. Jesus. I really started that creepy pasta, but the pick for the story is of a haunted house prop to me that looks like that. <laughs> Kill it with fire. <laughs> Three months of hell achievement unlocked. It's 2 a.m. Is it now? Have you forgotten already? The notes people leave behind seem to exist on the, on the edges of memory. So, oh, yeah, I've seen this, seen this shit before. All right, let me just get out of here, please. Thank you. So I have no map yet, and I, only, and I just have the crucifix. I'm just going to follow what the... Ooh! Oh, so if that deer be this deer, I, yeah. Notice aviso, the current investigation being conducted at Gallup Cemetery by the State of Connecticut Historical Society has been postponed till further notice. In the interim, we ask the public to avoid the cemetery grounds, the surrounding woods, any wildlife, and any unidentified persons roaming the area. Thank you for your patience. Great. And look where we are. Why, thank you. Mm hmm. Well, this doesn't look legit. Oh, it is. Dearest Disciple. Verily not everyone who says Lucifer, Lucifer, shall inherit his kingdom. You must first conjure his demon. You must then serve his demon. You must then walk among the children of men as his demon. Thus shall you receive the blessing of the unspeakable. Return to the safe family tomb whenever you are in need of rest, Gary. Return to the spirit house. Oh, all right. How about you? Okay. You guys are uh, looking kind of mean. It's me. So apparently that's me hitting the save button. It actually works. All right, cool. We out of here. So we can go right up and left. Will this gate open for me? No. Okay. No sweat. Damn. I was hoping I was onto something there. There's definitely something up here in the top corner. This little thing here, you can tell. Ah, I see. It opens the gate. That fucking moved. 100% that moved. Fucking prick. Oh, shit. That was only borderline scary. Oh, oh no. 
What the fuck is that? Fuck yourself, dude. So he's bouncing? Yeah, 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 thanks. Mortis to you, too. Really, they couldn't just pick this up when I entered the fucking hallway up ahead? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is even the main dude I was just looking for, either. Like, what is this? Oh, fuck, fuck, fuck. Fuck. Jesus, I can't tell where the fucking hitbox is sometimes. The problem is, once I start cruci uh, uh, put the crucifix up, you can't move. If I could move and use the crucifix, I'd be doing a lot better. What is that thing? No idea. Come on. Fuck me, dude. Anonymous door slam for the win. Oh, it was close. My word. No, no, no. Probed you with its noodle. Correct. Uh. Trying to dodge him in that spot is tough. I'm an Andrew. That's all I hear. Go up here. Oh! Gotcha, bitch. I just have to time it a bit better. Okay. I think I got him. Yeah. Hey. Nobody was thrilled when I got pregnant, not even a little happy. Even my doctor seemed to be judging me. Wow. Each time I'd leave the doctor's office, I'd see this strange woman across the street. All she'd do is stare at me and smile. No words, just a big, warm smile. Somehow it made those visits a little more bearable. Uh, after I lost the baby, oh, I saw her again across the street from the doctor's. Her smile was as big as ever. Oh, God. But somehow not as warm and friendly as, it, as I remember. Yes, I was walking was shocked to see the woman standing in the middle of the path. Now she was pregnant. She beckoned towards me. I followed her off the path into the woods. That's when I met Gary. That's odd. Alright, let's get another save point here. Doesn't work. Do I have to look at these fucks first or something? No. Can I only save it once? Did I fuck something up? I may have fucked something up. Whoopsie. Okay. Or maybe this is a safe spot for the demons. 
and I destroyed the save spot. No shit. Good thing I can go around it. Let me go the other way first. Before I get lost outside here. <laughs> it's locked. Boom. Don't like these. Especially you. Okay. Is this noxious fumes? Welcome to Oh fuck. What the fuck is that? Oh god, it's like running around through the clouds. Yo, Bill Salvi, thank you so much for the follow. Welcome to the mob. We're just playing some Faith, the Unholy what? Trinity, today. <laughs> Cletus the fetus. Oh my god. Nothing bad will happen here. Bill Salvi, how did you find us? Let's go up north first here. Channel 13? Awesome. Love to hear it when Channel 13 is well represented and people find some cool shit. It's good, good. Shit indeed. Uh, finding cool streamers. Um, appreciate you being here. What did I get myself into on this one? Okay. I may have to kill this thing down here first. That's what my uh, understanding is. So it hides in the clouds and then jumps just... Okay. This one's going to be tough. This game is pretty cool. I do appreciate it. Oh, I almost got fucking destroyed by him. Bye, bish. Losing grandpa was the hardest thing I ever experienced. We were really close. I cried about it for weeks. Then my stepmom introduced me to some of her friends. They asked me, would you like to see your grandfather again? I missed him so much, I was willing to try anything. That night, my stepmom drove me to one of her friend's houses. They took me down to the basement. I saw my grandfather in there, only it wasn't actually him. When I tried to run, they closed the basement door and locked me in. I can't remember much else from that night. My stepmom's friends are always coming by the house now. They tell me I have a debt to pay. They say they have work for me to do. Oh, God. A baby boom. The heads are missing off of these now. I've just noticed. I wonder if this will make me do anything now. No. I will just leave. I have to clear that fog somehow, I bet. How? No idea. This thing's still got ahead. I should be down to one? Eh, <laughs> just you. Nothing to do here? No? Okay. Great. So we'll head up north. And that gate is still locked, but we'll just go around. I don't have a map either, which really sucks. So I can get pretty lost pretty quickly. I think that's just a loop. <laughs> of 
great. I'll head straight up this way and see where it brings me. Because if it left will wrap me around, I bet your right will wrap me around. Because oh. I gotta have faith, you. I gotta have faith because I gotta, gotta have, have faith. Faith, Ooh. faith, I gotta have faith. Faith, faith. to have faith 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 all right so there's something to do in this other one then This part has me confuzzled, that's for sure. We still have the moving fog here. That shouldn't be a problem. There's gotta be a hint somewhere that tells me exactly which direction to go in up there. me out thanks search around the outside I guess couldn't hurt I mean it probably could oh good that's all fuck too <laughs> loops upon loops okay There's got to be a... There's got to be something. Grandpa note, pregnancy note. None of that is helpful. So the demons are supposed to come back here if they need help. That also just saved. I just watched it save again. But there's nothing I can really do here. Like, where's this key? It's gotta be a key somewhere. I'm gonna take a break from learning, I'm so confused. Oh, get yeah, bad. With your code development stuff, yeah. What's happening? Um, so, I'm trying to clear out demons from this cemetery. This place doesn't really help. Just keeps pack manning. <sighs> Excuse me. And I can't figure out what this thing is in the middle. I can't do anything for it. Like, there's no other, uh...
Yeah, there's really nothing else here. Okay, I was curious if there was a way to get like like key binds and see like what maybe there's other buttons that do something, but I don't think so. It's a very simplistic game. So simplistic. I don't know what to fucking do. Anytime I try to go somewhere, I just get put into a loop. I guess I'll travel over to the right side again, see if anything's changed. It's the only other place I haven't tried yet. Thank you. Appreciate you, Monster Mom. We've already hit this thing. I'll try it again. Yep, okay. Excuse me. I'll try the big tree here. Nothing. So this is the first boss fight. I'm banishing demons. Yes, in short. Problem is, I feel like I've run out of demons. I can't find the rest. And there's supposed to be a key somewhere to unlock the door to the north. <sighs> Up here. And I can't read any of these headstones or anything. So it's like there's no clues on it. You know what, let me try, because it's just the one colorful thing on here that isn't a crucifix. No? Okay. A lot less of that in this chapter. It's locked. <laughs> it's locked. Can I unlock it with the Lord? No? Okay. I don't think these bushes are doing anything for me. <laughs> it's locked. And the worst part? Repeat. It just keeps repeating. So I have no idea what has happened, what has befallen me. If I go to the right, boop. <laughs> so bizarre. I feel like I've crucifixed everything at least three times now. I'm even now crucif I'm throwing crucifix up to another crucifix in efforts to do something. Excuse me. Jesus. Fucking tired tonight. It was a long Monday for me. Um, I hope everyone else had a decent Monday. Or maybe even a good Monday. Quite good, thanks. Oh, good. Glad to hear it, sir. You're making me on. I, I'm see. I'm doing it on purpose, just for that reason entirely. <laughs> Shit. So I mean, there's no like. I I don't count any clues here at all. I mean, it does look like. Hold on. This thing here looks like the chest that goes up, and it looks like it's pointing to the right. 
This one... I don't know what that is. I don't know, but let's see. It looks kind of like it. So what if I just keep holding fucking D and see what's happened? It's okay, boring other than drinking. Huh. That's not too bad. If I just keep going to the right, is something going to happen? Keep holding your D. Yeah. You know it. Eventually, something's going to change. It has to. If I could get rid of this fucking fog, I bet you that's the problem. Man. Look at that again. This? Can't do anything to it. What, down here? Yeah, this thing looks like I need to go to the right. And then either this or this is the save room. I don't know what the fuck that thing is. Let me see what's down this way. If there's any one of those buildings that look like it. No, not really. All right, the cross at the top. Okay, so that's the second one. And then down here is the little reaper sitting on that thing. Hmm. Not much helping me here. Was there any other, was there actually any buildings up here? I think it was just crucifixes and tombstones. Yeah, nothing there. Tree, do you care to uh, expand a bit on what you're trying to say here? Because so far, I'm not figuring it out. Is it like this one over here looks like he's pointing to the right? This one maybe pointing north. This one's pointing west. And this one's like, it's good. <laughs> no worries, Twy. Um, if I go to the save building, essentially nothing. I mean, it saved. This dude's still sitting here. Can't do anything with the mirror. Because I already did something to it. Right, down, left. I don't know where you got down out of that. But I, I can tell you right now, going down is not going to work. Because going down actually makes me escape. Are you winning? Kind of. Maybe. So we go right, and then we go down, and it's going to actually bring me back here. See? So I can't go down. Hi, I'm Steve-O, and this is the Pussy Blast Off. So how do we do right up left instead? Riz, what is up? So it was right, and then we go up. And then we go left. How are you, my dear friend Liz? Riz. I say Liz? What the fuck? I didn't do anything.
Like, it's hard to see what this thing's even trying to say. It looks like it's doing this. <laughs> and then two, two up? I don't know. Let's do right up, left, up, up. A rough go of it lately, to be honest. I hate to see it. I'm uh, having a meh time myself with some shit that happened today. I'm hoping things get better for you. And then we go up again. And then one more time, because there's simply two arms up in the air. Nope. Ain't doing shit. Uh, I can't exit the cemetery, but I don't believe it's going to help anyway. Like, I can go either north or south to get out. In either direction, it seems like I'm just repeating the same spot over and over again until eventually I go back. I'll show you. Well, this goes back to this spot. That's not super helpful. Look, like I'll go this way to the left. It's like, oh, what's this? Huh. Okay. Let me head up this way and go check on the... Oh. <laughs> so it all just loops... It all just loops together. And then I need a key... open this door here which is strange it's locked. it's locked can't do anything about it and then I come up here I hit this spot and then if I keep going up I'll just appear down at the bottom and then left to right we'll just bring it bring back to that locked door what was in the tree below the entrance to the cemetery we'll take a look this tree here nothing Just blood or something no no I'll, I'll keep going I'll keep going oh yeah that had the uh, it was a dead deer I already I already used my uh, I already used the crucifix on it and then this just kind of just brings me back Threw everything back to the intro of the chapter. All I have is a crucifix. I can't examine anything. Then I don't know. Yeah. I kind of feel that. Fuck. Oh. <sighs> Game too hard, turn it off. <laughs> like, there has to be something to do with these statues here. These statues wouldn't be here otherwise. The 
problem is I have no idea. So like the one on the left, this one here, that one is up north. This one is the save building. This one I have no idea. This one I have no idea. Like, there's no buildings down here. Just tombstones, grass, and crucifixes. This is the saved building, plus a random pedestal oh, with a statue on it. Heavy motherfucking hand swings. This gorgeous asshole. Jug or nut. Welcome in, everybody. Welcome in. Wheeler's back here. Soma's back here again. Koisy Boise's here. Heavy fucked up. That's my clip. <laughs> it's a fine clip. We're, uh, of heavy, yes. We are struggle bussing through Faith the Unholy Trinity at the moment. Um, I like not having music at the moment because it's the same song on repeat. And I'm kind of going insane, but I digress. I uh, hope you're all doing well. Thank you for coming in. If you don't know me, I'm the Juggernaut. I play horror games. I'm part of Channel 13 on YouTube. If you haven't followed them and you enjoy laughing at people at the expense of them screaming and being jump scared, it is the YouTube channel to follow. Trust me. Faith will do that to you. Fair enough. Okay. So. Um, essentially, we've fought off two demons in this cemetery, but there's a third one I have to get to, and I feel like these headless statues are telling me something. We are lost, yes. And it looks like a directional that to go in, but it's not really helpful. And I can't, like, change their direction or anything like that. All I can do is hold a crucifix up. It's not doing anything. Riz is here. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. And then if I walk up here, boop, I'm down below again. Then I go walk down here, and now I'm back here. There's nothing I could do in this save temple. This is the last, like, demon I have to handle, but I can't, I can't actually do anything to him. And these other two skulls were definitely lit up with red eyes as well before, so I wonder if that's each of the boss battles I've gone through. So the problem is I need to get to the next little battle. I have no idea how to get to it because everything is looping over itself and I can't go anywhere. And this fucker down here moved and I can't do anything about it. Aha! Uh -huh. It's with great sadness that the Sterling community announces the passing of Cindy Mary Martin, 38 and Robert Kimball Martin, 40. Devoted husband and wife and beloved parents, their lives tragically came to an end on September 21st due to an accident in their home. Bob was a training advisor for the United States Navy, and Cindy was a CPA and, more recently, a stay-at-home mother. They were married March 12, 1969, in Voluntown. Though not particularly religious, they taught their children to be kind, generous, and involved in the community. A public closed cast memorial will be held at Tillinghast Funeral Home at 10 a.m. Thursday. Burial services will proceed shortly after. Bob and Cindy are survived by their daughter, Amy, and twin boys, Nate and Jason. Ah, okay, so Amy is the girl that was possessed. Uh-oh, I'm going to sleep. Night all. <laughs> Night tree. Thank you so much for hanging with me as usual, bud. Appreciate you big time. So I wonder if any more of these are going to light up on me when I use my crucifix. So that's what I'm going to do now. This dude doesn't do anything. I've tried. 
And then going up to the right side, it only has that little tiny doll that I've already used the crucifix on. Yeah, that purple thing, I've already got that. This is where one of the uh, little battles was. We fought a dude that looked like he had a noodle coming out of his head. Hmm. This is devastating, though. Like, I really want to figure this out. And they are not making it easy. You think the door is still locked? Let's go find out. We'll ask ourselves. It's locked. Yeah, it's locked. Thank you, Stephen Hawking's. There's a bunch of more crucifixes down below too, but let me go check these other ones. I've already checked these statues. They don't fucking do me anything good. No. 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 Because maybe there'll be a note somewhere that actually gives me a hint. Nope. 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 Not even the goddamn little grass. I can't recall if there were any up here. Let me check. There are two. Technically three. Nope. Nope. I've already tried to crucifix the fucking thing in the middle so many times. Okay. I really hope I can figure out the hint here. We have about 30 minutes left in stream. Alright, there's a bunch of them here. I gotta have something to go with. There we go. Any more in here, or is it just that one? Just wanna make sure. Alright, good. Let's see. I shook hands with the devil. I looked him in the eye. He looked like a long lost friend. Okay. All hope is lost. Indeed. Super helpful. Oh yeah, that's a dead deer chopped up in a fucking tree. You know. In case you wanted to see that. I wonder if it's going to loop me around now. Okay. If I go to the right. Damn it. Yep. Everything loops like that in this level. And none of these notes really tell me there's no like good hints that explain anything else really I mean the only thing that's even close what I can tell are these statues do I just keep going to the right because this thing is definitely up here Maybe go back to the guy in the save thing. Maybe you're supposed to shake his hand now. I mean, maybe. Worth a shot, I guess. 
But I feel like they, because they used to be three of them in there, now there's only one. It's They've gone one by one disappeared as I defeated a demon outside. I know you're grasping, it's okay. To hold my crucifix up to these crosses. That'll do it. That'll learn them. And then these woods here is just a repeating thing. Wrap around, I go. Uh, going up above, it actually does loot me. So I'll go up here. I hit the top, it immediately brings me back down to the bottom of this same window. See? And then if I go down, it brings me back. Like, I gotta find that key. I'm kind of losing it too. I'm like, uh, like, what's going on? I'm going to look for any type of keywords in here. Trying to shake your hand, why won't it work? Maybe there's something to do with the little uh, Reaper guy over here. No guides. I was thinking about looking one up. As much as I don't want to. Because I just feel like this game is supposed to be pretty simplistic. And I'm just being stupid about something. No guide those light up. I just wanted to make sure. No, I wouldn't say the notes are doing that. 
listening with your eyes closed waiting for headache to go away yeah the song's not going to help you with that yeah i don't think the notes are moving um based on the other parts of the game that i've been playing but the notes tend to be just secondary because i didn't get all of them in the first chapter Even worse than Bloonies, that gave me headaches, and I got it a minute, two more playthroughs until 100%. <laughs> this just is not helpful at all. I have not fought the third demon, no. So I don't know how to get to him. My understanding is that I'm either going to find the third one through one of these pathways. If I get the fog to go away, I guess, maybe. Or this will bring me to where the key is. And then the key will uh, unlock that other door out in the woods. He appears after you fight the three demons. Okay. So the third demon has to be up there somewhere. I just don't know how to get to him. Unfortunately. Uh, just trying to think. Thank you. You know, let's try to go all the way back to the beginning and see what happens. We'll just follow that path all the way back and see where it brings me to. Maybe there'll be something back there I can snag. I used the crucifix on that and got something. Back through here. All right, it works. This is where we started. It would also be nice if I had a map of this place. Oh, yep. Now I've done a loop. I bet you the right will loop me eventually. Bizarre. Hmm. 
Yes, the mist demon we we killed, and then the one with like the noodle coming out of his head we killed. Check every shrubbery. Wait. You fought one that looked like it had an umbilical cord? Yes, I did. He was over to the right. Ow. He was over to the right and then up to the north. And then the mist guy was to the left and then to the south. Can't do anything special with that. Uh, uh, excuse me. Great. <laughs> uh, trying to get tired. We've got like 15 minutes left. I think the game is glitched. What the fuck is that? I'm looking into this a bit more. All right, so it says here that the northwest area lies a maze, draw much all the direction of the statues are pointing in the room below. And it says right up, left up. Well, I'm pretty sure I fucking did that. So right. Up. Left. And up. It doesn't work. Do, 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 do. The yeah, umbilical cord demon, okay. If you fight them in order, I mean, I guess.
Yeah, I'm not super positive. It seems like one of the demons just isn't activating. Yeah, that's what it feels like. Let's do, um... Let's quit to main menu. New background unlocked. Fine. Chapter 2, continue, here we are, so let's see, woo, new background, so right up, left up, which I've done, I know I have, because Tree thought the second one was down, so we go to the right, and then we go up, I did it. Left, up, right, up. The game knew you needed something. It's... Yeah, I don't... I don't know. It doesn't seem like it's working. It might be kind of glitched out or something. Oh. Do, 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 do. I like how there's a walkthrough for chapter three. I found Okay, let's see You are free to take these demons on in any order, but for the sake of consistency, this guy will list them in order of the note numbers. Okay.
so weird. It just gives me the same information. Right, up, left, up. Right. Up. Left. What the fuck was that? Did you see that? Oh, fuck. All right, it worked. Jesus fuck. All right, I've been freed. No more overbearing father turned violent alcoholic. No more hiding my bruises and cuts. No more pills and needles. No more getting laughed at and kicked around. They'll never laugh at me again. By day, my body withers away, but by night, my mind explores forbidden worlds of power and knowledge, guided by beings of pure darkness. I have been trusted with secret knowledge of the demon seal. I have learned the correct conjuring sign, drawing the inverted star along the rocks arranged in five, first at the top left point and then down. I will lure them into the woods, then I will show them my power. That's not good. I think it may have been glitched out earlier. What the fuck happened to the dude? The statue's different. Uh, oh shit! Ow, stabbed myself in the eye, but at least I got the key. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, good, the statue's back to normal over here. Doesn't matter. Okay, we have the key. Let's go unlock the door. It's no longer locked. Oh. Save family legacy? Yeah. Interesting. Like, you figure at least one of these has to have something hidden underneath it, right? What the fuck was that? Okay. Who's that running up there? She guards the door to underground purgatory. I hath not seen her. Children fear her. Well, I kind of want to chase the dude that just went around back. Can I do that? Of course. I had to come back. I had to walk through the corn one last time. I wasn't sure what I would find. The dogs? The children? The thing that took them? It had been five years. I couldn't even find the little graves anymore. I just walked in the field until I found that stupid grinning scarecrow. I just listened to the night wind blowing through the crops. It was like the scarecrow was mocking me. I turned around to go back, and that's when I heard it behind me. Well, it was more like I felt it. I didn't dare turn around. We just stood there. Me, the scarecrow, and the doomed child. Finally, I mustered up a tiny bit of courage and turned to look and immediately fled in the opposite direction, crashing through the rows of corn. I ran too. What little I saw of it drained the blood from my face and made my skin crawl. I say it because whatever I was looking at didn't have a face, just a bloody gaping hole. What the fuck?
Okay, keep going into the corn here. Again? Uh. I'm not super certain any of that was really helpful. All right, we'll go into the house then. Confess thy sins. No, I refuse. Day one of our paranormal investigation into the old Snake Meadow Hill Church. We've got three cameras, a box of tapes, and enough beer and beef jerky to last us a week. On our way in, we asked some of the lo locals about the church. It's most of the stories we had heard before. Evil spirits dragging children into the cornfield and secret tunnels under the chapel. But there was this spindly lady game that we hadn't heard yet. Apparently has to do with summoning the spirit of a woman who used to take care of the orphans back in the 50s. There was even an old rhyme they told us. Walk the church from room to room. Maybe you will see her. But she will move when you do. But never try to trick her. Awesome. We're going to try the game tonight as soon as we get settled in. Great. Check to the left. Beef jerky sounds good right about now. Yeah, it's it's true. There we go. Night three. Shouldn't have come here. <laughs> Tape's missing. Lars stuck behind basement door. Henry hasn't come back yet. Can't leave anyway. We missed night two, night one and two, but that's. Pray for me, Father, for I am sick. What seats have you got to get this? I try to save a girl from evil. But my fears overcame me. I turned my back on the ministry. And broke my vows to God. A year later, the girl reached out to me again. But in the end, I couldn't save her. I left her to die. I am sorry for me and my past sins. Thou hast said will. Here is my penance. Greet the child to me. Perform the sad of the attrition. And thou shalt have the peace thou seekest. Give thanks to the Lord for his good. For his mercy and yours forever. Fuck. How did I get here? And what is that a picture of right here? Oh, God. Night one. We still haven't found a way into the basement, but we found something just as cool. A secret passage in the old confession booth leading to this hallway. Henry's going into town to buy a crowbar. We'll see if we can't get these boards off of some of the doors. But that's not even the best part. We caught an EVP. You can't hear it on tape very well, but to us, it kind of sounded like laughing. Thank God we brought the nice mic. We'll review it on the sound gear once we get back into town. Where's the priest with the child? Oh, fuck. God damn. Is that a crowbar right there up against the wall? Guess not. What about this way? All right, we will back that ass up, and I'm just going to head up here and see what I can do up here. It is after 1 a.m., so if I die anytime soon, that's going to do it. All right, so this must be the chapel, the actual church. Uh 
Oh, okay. Do you mean to do that? By and by me? Night two. We're going to be rich. We've caught supernatural stuff on camera before, sure. Doors opening on their own, things falling off the shelves, but nothing like this. Same while we were try, uh, trying this spindly lady game again. One of the candles on the floor lit up by itself as soon as Lars walked into the room. It was nuts. We got it all on film. We're going to make a fortune selling this to TV stations. Hmm. Head over here to the right. See if there's anything over here. Watch the chandelier. No, watch the candles. Oh. Whoa. I don't understand the point about the candles. Watch the candles, okay. So those top two. That's the right two. This would be middle and right. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I think I'm at a loss for now. I mean, the candles help provide direction, but it's not super clear. And I think I'm running out of gas here, to be honest. Um, but we'll definitely come back and play this some more because it is a good game. I do, I do like it. Ah. Oh. My goodness, same for real. Uh, well, the unfollowed demo was fun. Um, I hope they're still working on it, and I hope it gets a full release because I would like to play it. Um, and Faith is pretty good. I feel like we're pretty close to the end of Chapter 2, and then there's Chapter 3, which is the final chapter. So we'll have to squeeze it in some more time. Good night, Yug. Thanks, Riz. Good night to you. Laser, thank you to you. Thanks again for that throne purchase earlier today. It was really, really nice of you, even though I really don't want to do it. Good night, everyone. Much love. Twy's going to try and sleep off the headache. Love you guys. Love you too, Twy. Get some sleep. It's good for you when you can get it. Let's see. Who we got on tonight? It looks like we might be doing corn. The husk of corn. We just double check and make sure there's no one else on because sometimes I can't really tell who's who on here. Yeah, corn husk is on. 
He's playing Fear. Day, he's on uh, day, uh, I guess he's doing weeks, just a, a week of Fear. And this appear, appears to be the first one. I haven't played them in a long time. This is fun. Well, I'm glad you had fun, IDK. Appreciate you. Love having you in here. Um, yeah, but I'm going to get out of here, though. Um, we're going to go raid Corn Husk Show. If you have not hung out with Corn, when we get there, please drop him a follow. Super, super wholesome guy. Great horror streamer. Bill, thanks again for being here. Good night to you as well. Thank you, Knox. Glad you were here. Um, so we're going to kick this off. There's some messages coming across right now. For subscribers, you can grab that first one. Uh, for anyone else, you can grab the second one, which has like the uh, the red raid and pickaxe in it. Uh, subscribe to the YouTube. Follow me on TikTok and Twitter. And uh, Discord, of course, is always open to everybody. Come on in. Uh, great discussions. Um, we have a question of the day bot, which is pretty interesting and fun. Good conversations rolling. And the NSFW channel is yikes. <laughs> it is something. Um, but yeah, I think that's going to do it for tonight. I'm going to kick off this raid. Uh, get those messages ready to dish out when we get over there. Uh, and yeah, please drop them a follow if you haven't. Uh, I will be back on Thursday. Thursday? Yes, Thursday the 23rd. It's the start of my on-call week, unfortunately. We'll be playing Pinewood Valley, the alpha release. Um, through uh, Hopefully the Steam release. I mean, if it's only a Chiyo because of a setback, fine. There's a lot of updates that went through, so I'm hopeful that it's going to be better compared to what it was when it first dropped, I think, on Friday. It was not looking too good, I guess. But, uh, yeah, I'll see you all on Thursday. Have a good night. Stay healthy. Take care of yourselves. And, I don't know, I don't have a catchphrase for this. Have a good night. <laughs>